everyone, we're going to sketch the curve and find the area that it uh, encloses. R equals 2 sine of theta. So by the time you're doing the area, you should have an idea that this is a circle. I went ahead and put some values in here just to sketch the curve. Um, at negative pi over 2, uh, that's at negative 2. So I'm going to go by uh, 2. So this is going to be 1, and this is going to be 2. So we're at here. So each circle is like 1 half. All right, at negative uh, pi divided by 3, this is going to be negative square root of 3. So there we have that. That's about 1 and 1, uh, 1.73. So that's going to be close to 2. So go up here, close to 2. And at um, pi divided by 6, that's negative 1, but it's negative pi divided by 6. So there's your 1. And then we're at 0. And then it just kind of goes around um, some more. This is going to be at 1.73 at pi divided by 6. And at pi divided by uh, 3, it's going to be uh, very close to 2. And then you're back at 2. So here we go. There it is. There's my circle. So basically, they just want you to sketch the circle. It doesn't have to be perfect. And um, the area that encloses is this area here. And therefore, we're going from 0 to pi. All right, so let's go ahead and do that. Set up the area. Our area is going to be equal to the integral from 0 to pi of 1 half using this formula, r squared d theta. So our r is 2 sine of theta. Therefore, this is going to equal uh, the integral from 0 to pi. I'm going to go ahead and pull the 1 half in front. And this is going to be 4 sine squared of theta d theta. Uh, for integration, uh, we're going to use the identity for sine squared. And I'm going to go ahead and pull this 4 out. So I'm going to put 4 times 1 half. That's going to be 2. I'll just keep it here. Times 1 half. And then we have from 0 to pi. And I'm going to write this as um, 1 half times 1 minus cosine of 2 theta with that identity. All right. So basically, this equals 2. You take half of 2, so that goes away. So basically, we're just integrating this piece. So that's going to equal... Um, for 1, it's going to be, this is, let me write 2, 1 half of 2 is 1. So that, this all goes away. Uh, get theta minus 1 half sine of 2 theta. And we're evaluating from 0 to pi. So this is going to equal pi minus 0 minus 0 minus 0. So this equals pi. And also note, this is a circle with a radius of 1. And so its area is going to be pi uh, times 1 squared, which equals pi. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.